Another Jefferson Parish family wanting answers is the family of Modesto Reyes. He was fatally shot by a deputy on May 27th. An independent autopsy reveals new details in his death. As Mike McDaniel explains, the sheriff's office isn't releasing any evidence because the sheriff says he wants to protect the integrity of the case. The Reyes family sees things differently. <laughs> An independent autopsy at the request of the family of Modesto Reyes gives his siblings some insight to the circumstances surrounding their brother's death. Based on the autopsy, it gave us the answers that we knew that we felt in our heart from the beginning. The Reyes family gave us the preliminary report from the Louisiana Forensic Center. According to that report, Reyes was shot twice in the back. From the stories that the police office, the police statement said, it just didn't add up from what we found out by the autopsy. Cause of death is noted as two gunshots to the back. The report also shows a gunshot through the left arm and possibly one in the leg. Reyes, who does have a criminal history, was shot May 27th after Sheriff Joe Lepinto says he tripped and fell while running from a traffic stop in Marrero. Lepinto says Reyes was on the ground when he turned over and pointed a gun at the two deputies who were chasing him. It tells that because he was shot squarely in the back, it gives us the impression that Modesto could not have been turning around. Obviously, someone lost their life. I, I don't want it to happen. My deputy didn't want it to happen. I have no doubt about that. While deputies don't wear body cameras, there is video from a taser, which automatically turns on when a deputy pulls it out of its holster. A short clip was shown to media outlets, including WWL by the sheriff's office. It shows a man face down before turning over. Once he was facing up, it appears he had two guns, one in each hand. That's when shots are fired. My deputies are put in tough situations. Uh, in this case, uh, Medessa Reyes, I've said it before and I'll say it again, had two guns, one of which was stolen. Uh, he put my deputy in a very bad position at that time. The Reyes family hasn't seen that video, and Lepinto says because it's an active investigation, none of the evidence is being released. Lepinto expects independent autopsies to line up with the evidence, but says he's not able to share everything with the family. Modesto Reyes has a family. Um, I, I don't take that away from, from anybody. Um, their family members are, are missing a loved one right now. I understand that. I'm gonna catch you. Only having an independent autopsy report, the Reyes family feels they're being kept in the dark, only getting information from what's being reported in the news. We just want justice. We just want them to come to us and prove to us, like, why on it and they think everything was justified. A lawsuit has not been filed against the sheriff's office in this case, but attorneys do expect one. A demand letter has been issued for the release of that video as the family now waits for the full autopsy report. Mike McDaniel, Eyewitness News.